right now it's just me and Layla. My wife's at work. Say hi. Hi. So we're gonna go drop off all the packages for you guys' orders, which thank you a lot. That helped out a lot. I wanna clean house before we start ordering some more stuff for 2018. Then we're gonna go put some gas, get some breakfast, and we have to wait for my wife to get off work, and then we're gonna go hit up uh, Vasquez Rocks just to get out the house and enjoy my day off. So thanks again, guys, for the orders. Uh, I appreciate it. And we'll ship them out right now. They're all in here. And then we'll... Yeah, just wait for my wife and then we'll head out. So, say bye. Bye. That's my truck. That's your truck or my truck? Uh, my. That's your truck? Oh. Yeah, that's my truck. My little, little... Come on, let's go. Let's go home. Goodbye. Bye. All right, what's up, guys? <clears throat> so yesterday, we were supposed to go to Vasquez Rocks. Layla knocked out, so we couldn't go. If we would have gone any later, that 45-minute drive there would have turned into a two-and-a-half-hour drive back to the traffic. So, yeah, I'm going to head out there today. Just got an interview, so I'm going to head out there right now. I'm trying to beat this rain, get some footage, get a video out, and... Yeah, so I'll see you guys when we get there. What's up guys? So I'm here at Vasquez Rocks, flying the drone around right now. I came out here by myself. Uh, Liz is at my mother-in-law's, my wife's at work. I don't work till 9 p.m. tonight, so just wanted to get out the house. I had an interview today. It wasn't for the job that I wanted, but I mean right now anything is better than Harbor Freight because the schedule's killing me, bro. Like Tonight I work 9 to 4. Come home, sleep for a couple hours, I have to be back at work at noon. I work from noon to close and then Sunday I'm off. But what's stupid is that they give you these days off where it's like it's not really off because Sunday I'm, I'm off all day but then I go into work Monday at midnight. So that means I have to be in bed by like 6 to get a good nice rest so that way I don't get fucking screwed on Monday. Which is stupid because then so then Monday I would be getting off at 8 in the morning and then they want me back 
at 1 p.m. So I'm just tired of it. Like it's pointless. It's pointless being there. They don't give a fuck about anybody but themselves and how much money they make. And I was telling Tahoe, like, if people knew the profit that this company's making, like, it's disgusting. Like, but whatever. I mean, it's a good place. They have good shit that you can use once in a while, but it's a bullshit company. But yeah, there's enough about that. I'm out here. I'm just gonna do some exploring, send the drone back up. Right now, it just switch the battery, and then we'll go climb this bitch, and hopefully, I don't fall and die. So, stay tuned. So I guess I'm not gonna send the drone back up. Uh, I had it up right now for about, I don't know, about 10, 15 minutes. No one said anything. Rangers drove by, they waved at me. So I was like, all right, cool, whatever. But right now, older gentleman walked by or drove by and he hands me that it's a no drone zone, which is fine, I understand. But at least I got my footage, so. Oh well. So right now I'm just gonna do some exploring and go walk around a bit. Can't send the drone back up. Oh, well, I might send the drone back up once this fucker leaves. So, yeah. So we're gonna go climb this bitch. Hopefully I don't fall. I'm gonna get my shoes on. And then let's go do this shit. Sorry, I don't know if you can you guys you can hear me or the wind's fucking it up, but I don't know if you guys can see them, but there's two people up there and one of them just ate complete fucking shit and rolled down. So, therefore, I will not be climbing this shit because it's just me and them out here. And if we all die, I'll be out here because it's us three out here. So Alright, so instead of climbing that shit and falling like he did because his fucking knee is gushing, I'm gonna walk the path and look for rattlesnakes. I think it's a little bit safer to look for rattlesnakes than to be up there like an idiot. So people don't realize that that shit's easy to climb. Anybody can climb that. But getting down fucking sucks. Getting down is where you're just scary. So. Instead, I'm like looking for rattlesnakes. Because last time I came, my wife saw one, but I didn't see one, which kind of bummed me out. And we had Layla, so we couldn't really chase it. All right, so I've been walking for a while now, and I can't fucking find any. All I see is fucking birds and rats and some kind of weird looking squirrels. I can hear them, I just can't find them. I'm pretty sure they're up there somewhere. But. I guess I won't be able to find them today. What really pisses me off is it's such a nice trail, and I wish I could fucking drive through this. And it makes me so mad that just because a few people complain, they're like, no, no more vehicles. Because I remember back in the day, I used to be able to drive through this. It used to be fucking awesome. Because you could just do the whole park and you do the whole tour from your vehicle. For people like me that, I'm not into hiking. Hiking to me is just walking and getting tired. So. Sorry guys, no rattlesnake today. Hopefully one pops up right now on the way back to the car. All right, what's up guys? So I came back to the truck for a nice refreshing 
healthy beverage. Like I said, I'm not used to hiking. So while I'm here, I decided to show you guys what these motherfuckers did. They bent the shit out of the lock, which it would have been a lot easier to cut this, but now I gotta just bend this back. Um, they kind of like forced it down. You really can't see it, but they pushed it down completely. And then as far as the latch, let me see if I can find it. There we go. So the latch goes here, and then it goes over the jerry can, and then that's what they did. So they just bent the shit out of it, which I mean, it's no big deal. It was a fucking jerry can from Harbor Freight, and I got another one, so I really don't care. What just pisses me off is that, like, why go through all that trouble for an empty jerry can? Like, come on, dude. But whatever. Fuck them. When I find him, he'll get his. Uh, he knows who I am, so. But whatever. The only thing that I'm having a problem with is I, I hit up a Smitty Belt and they don't sell the latch by itself. So I gotta come up with a new one. So I wanna do probably a way solid one, like a way better one, or I just wanna weld the jerry can straight to this and then just have a jiggler which is this so all you do is pretty much just jiggle it and then it starts to send the fuel so just bring it over this way so i think i might do that just permanently weld it on but yeah that's what happened no big deal you know people are fucking stupid that's why i just can't wait to move that's why i want to get the fuck out of the city too many problems too much drama too many people know who i am and you know whatever so yeah that's an update on that um really leaning towards the weld probably just gonna weld that bitch on keep it permanently